Confused? Well, just think of Wall Street as a giant church bake sale, only with less backstabbing. And think of collateralized debt obligations as the brownie table. All sorts of folks have brought brownies to sell, mostly to each other. But Mrs. Havermeyer has a secret recipe. When she makes brownies, she puts a little bit of shit in her batter. Not a lot, just a Hershey squirt. That lets her turn a bigger profit on her brownies because baking with shit saves her money on more expensive ingredients like things that don't come out of your anus. All the other bakers see how much profit Mrs. Havermeyer is making, so they buy her shit batter and mix it in with their own and naturally shit in their own batter to sell it to each other. And everything goes fine until Reverend Smithson bites into a brownie and says, oh my God, this is shit. At this point, no one can remember which brownies don't have shit in them. And boom, suddenly nobody's buying brownies and the bake sale collapses. And just because of one tiny little world-crippling incident, the government wants to come in with a bunch of new rules. They want to make it against the law to put shit in brownies. And not just brownies, but cookies, blondies, cupcakes, muffins, all the baked goods. Do you really want a bureaucrat coming between you and your banana dingleberry loaf? Our system is based on risk. Wall Street can't have regulators peering over their shoulder. It's like when you're trying to pee. If there is someone watching you, it's harder to do. So just let the free market pee and it will trickle down and warm everybody. And if eventually that pee lands in Mrs. Havermeyer's brownies, well, they'll certainly be moist. Besides, who's going to notice with all that shit in there?